On this episode, we introduce you to Salon Independence, a brand new way to look at salons. to celebrate Whoa. hey what's up everybody and welcome to another hashtag celebrate Columbus show my name is Josh Burnett and I'm excited about today's episode we're gonna be talking to salon independence recently the salon owner John reached out to me and we talked about their brand new concept with salon independence it's revolutionizing the salon industry and I'm really excited to show you Columbus what's going on in the east part of Columbus. I hope that you enjoy this episode of the Hashtag Celebrate Columbus Show. Salon Independence is not a traditional type salon that um, most people are used to seeing in the Columbus area. This new concept is essentially where stylists come in and they open their own business within salon independence. So while they lease the room, it's different than traditional type booth rental. It's in this environment, stylists can come and go as they please. They have 24 hour access. Um, they sell their own retail and they just have their own freedom of running their own independent salon rather than working for somebody else or working and renting a chair from somebody else. All their profits, everything, they keep 100% of everything. I would encourage people to work at Salon Independence just because you're, it's all based on you. It's all going to be, you know, what you put into it. If you succeed, it's all you. Nobody's going to be able to take that credit from you and nobody's ever going to be, you know, over you telling you you have to be here from eight to five or nobody's going to tell you that you can't use that retail product that you love so much um, and nobody's going to be taking a cut of your services telling you that oh you know you you did the service but I need a percentage of that because it's my building or my business you know it's all your business so there's nobody that's going to be over you you know taking anything from you it's all based on booth rent and everywhere else you are paying a booth rent just the same so why not have your own business doing it I enjoy Salon Independence because my clients really like the privacy that they have when they come here and I have my own space and I can lock my own door and come and go as I please. The stylists that we have at Salon Independence, they come here with an established clientele. So they already have established themselves in the industry. They're excellent stylists. Um, they're highly trained, highly motivated. We have got a ton of education classes that we perform here for our stylists. So they're up to date on everything that's going on. And as a community, you know, supporting my stylist would be the best thing that this community could do. I, I made a huge investment when I came to Columbus in this facility. And I supported all local businesses. Um, Gecker Construction did the whole entire build out at Seymour, Indiana. Uh, Mark Ridker from Fast Signs did my signage. So I've, I've used a lot of people in the community um, trying to come here to develop you know, more sustainability for Columbus and supporting my stylist would be huge to me. I used to work for um, a corporation as a stylist and the difference between working for a corporation versus my own is the clients can now contact me for their appointments versus calling into a corporation shop and having to talk to a stylist to make an appointment because sometimes there can be a lot of confusion and a lot of double booking when you work for a corporation. And as my own business owner, I can schedule my own appointments and make sure that the double booking doesn't happen. I'm a former stylist myself, so I know what it's like to stand behind the chair and, and work and do hair. I thought about how incredible it would be for stylists to literally be able to come and open up their own salon. They come here and everything's done. What it needed in this concept was additional support for stylists. Stylists 
sometimes need help on a financial level with organization, um, education, marketing. We offer all that here. So I took everything out of the concept that I've done in, in big cities and I brought it here and I developed these programs to help stylists and entrepreneurs succeed in their individual business in here. I was drawn to Columbus mainly because of the architecture that I saw in this town. When I first visited the city, I was doing demographic research. So being the sixth largest city in Indiana, as well as next to no unemployment rate. Um, you've got Cummings Engine here, which is very supportive to the community. And so besides demographically, when I visited here, I saw the architecture, I saw the diversity of the community, and I literally fell in love with this town. Um, it's a very creative town, and I just really love the diversity.